I'm Teresa Lopez. I'm a clinical product specialist with Butterfly, and today I'm going to show you Pulse Wave in the carotid preset. To begin, I'll select my carotid preset, and I'm going to place the probe just above the clavicle. You'll see the internal jugular vein collapsing, and you'll see the common carotid artery medial to it. I can slide my probe superior towards the patient's head to do a quick survey. If I wanted to take a pulse wave tracing, I will tap my actions menu and select pulse Doppler under modes. I'll turn my probe in long axis, and I will place the sample volume in the center of the vessel. I can also adjust my angle by tapping on the white circle and you can see the angle change. To begin tracing, I'll tap on start spectrum and if I wanted to adjust the baseline, I can slide the baseline up or down for the desired setting. Take a measurement. I'll press freeze. I'll go into my measurement menu and select line. I will place my first caliper on peak systole and take my second caliper and place it on end diastole. You'll see on the screen PSV for peak systolic velocity and EDV for end diastolic velocity measurements. And that's how you perform the pulse wave Doppler in the carotid preset in the Butterfly IQ+.